If you're planning to use your After Effects composition in Premiere Pro or in a video project that you're going to edit in Premiere Pro, don't worry about rendering it. Simply go to Premiere, File, Adobe Dynamic Link, and import your After Effects composition. You do have to know where you've saved your composition. And you can see when I click on my After Effects file, I can bring in multiple compositions. So for example, I'm going to bring in these two right here, Countdown and Celine Carr. Hit OK. And if I pull these and move them to the timeline, you can see they're animating. I'm going to go ahead and click on this one, the title one, move it up to the top. You can see it even um, retains its transparency. So that black layer, when I was animating, was just the background, wasn't even a layer. So um, I could put that right over the top. And here's the really neat thing. Let's say I decide, oh, you know, I, I really like this, but I don't like the five being red. I can simply right click on it in Premiere Pro, hit Edit Original, it'll launch After Effects. I can go in there, make my change. Let's say I don't want this to be red anymore. I can make it white. And I'm going to save it, go back to Premiere and it'll automatically update in Premiere. So that's a, that's a really nice advantage of working with the Adobe Creative Cloud.